Hey everyone, this is just my update for the week. Um, I'm doing pretty good this week. It's been kind of touch and go. You know, when you make life changes, is not ever um, effortless. It's always a struggle. And um, my upside is previously, like a couple months ago, I probably ate a lot more snacks than I do these days. So I was working downtown and I worked in a team where people like snacks were at my job like they were like candy bars and my boss she's a really lovely person she would come in with candy and chocolate so I don't have those temptations I still have to fight my chip addiction I told you I love chips um but this week I've been doing pretty good I've been trying to eat a vegetable with lunch so today I did angel pasta and I had it with yellow squash and that I sauteed and some orange peppers and then I added um, some Kalula which is kind of like it's in the family the green family like collard greens and it tastes like spinach um, it's really good uh, so I had that, and um, tonight, uh, what I did last night, which was really good, is I made some lentils. I made the base of some lentil soup with like a bunch of uh, bay leaves and um, garlic, cloves, onions, um, tomatoes, and some other vegetables. And so, I kind of drained the lentil soup and the, the other stuff, and I rolled that into a veggie burger, which I will cook tonight. That will be dinner with like some rice and some other vegetables. I haven't haven't fully planned out my dinner for tonight, but it won't be McDonald's. So um, I've been doing really, really good, and um, uh, my water count is real low today. I just I'm tired. <laughs> I'm real, real tired, and. Um, it was a stressful day at work, so. <laughs> but I'm very glad that I bypassed the McDonald's in the corner and I came home to get my water and to get me like eat up. I'll probably eat a banana later on, something like that. Um, lately, I've been trying to eat like um, popcorn that I make at home, and I'm still working on getting some other tools. I'm gonna buy me a new blender, and I'm going to. Um, I need to beef up some stuff that I've been missing. Uh, I don't have any quinoa, uh, which is a whole grain that I usually, you can use quinoa. It has a lot of protein and it's really good for you. Um, so that's pretty much my midweek um, update. I think I'll do good through the rest of the week, but tomorrow might be a challenge. I have a training and I, I don't have control over the food tomorrow, but I, what I can do is... Um, if they have fruit and vegetables, use those as sources. I don't have to eat eat a lot of bread if I don't want to. And as you see, my neck, I'm so proud of my neck. <laughs> it is looking good. I also wore some old slacks today that are even more looser. So I take the small little blessings. I love it. But yeah, I'm saying um, I am continuing with my juicing. Ooh. So tonight I'm going to do beet. I know you're thinking, no. I'm going to do beet with some carrots and some other mixtures, but beet is something that I try to juice or eat on a regular basis because it lowers my blood pressure. And it naturally lowers it. No need for me to take a pill. And, um, and I feel like I've been on track of things that I need to do. So, as the week goes, I'll be excited to go to the grocery this weekend. I'm going to try um, some different recipes for juicing. And I'm going to go back to doing some raw smoothies. So um, stay plugged in. I, I eventually will like share some of my recipes. And um, I'm working on a cookbook called Kitchen Cuisines, um, which I hope to release hopefully by my birthday. I'm still working on uh, a few recipes in there. But that's it for now. So this is me signing out on June 13th. Mwah. Leave me any messages if you would like. 
at mocha.sister at gmail.com. You can hit me up on Facebook as well. And uh, that's pretty much it. Um, take care. And um, I'm looking forward to talking to you guys about health. So let's keep the conversation going.